The overall goal of this procedure is to biochemically reconstitute a steroid receptor HSB90 protein complex and reactivate steroid receptor ligand binding activity, which can be used to test HSB90 cofactor requirements and the effects of adding exogenous compounds to the reconstitution process. This is accomplished by first preparing cell cytosol-containing functional glucocorticoid receptors. Next, the GR from the cell cytosol is immunoadsorbed and endogenous HSP90 is dissociated. Then, the GR-HSP90 heterocomplex is reconstituted using an exogenous source of HSP90 and other chaperone proteins and cofactors. Finally, the reconstituted protein complexes and ligand binding activity are analyzed. Specifically, methods such as SDS-PAGE, Western blotting, and radioactive ligand binding assays are used to show GRHSP90 heterocomplex formation and steroid binding activity. This method can help answer key questions in the HSP90 molecular chaperone field, such as what cofactors, chaperones, and co-chaperones are required to facilitate HSP90 functional activity. Though this method can provide insight to protein folding, it can also be applied to other systems, such as developing HSP90-dependent lead compounds and analysis of HSP90-mediated intracellular signaling pathways. Demonstrating the procedure will be Hannah Franklin and Nathan Furukawa, two recently graduated students from my laboratory. To isolate functional glucocorticoid receptor, or GR, Grow mouse fibroblast L929 cells, or SF9 cells, that have been infected with recombinant GR baculovirus and are in the exponential growth phase. Centrifuge the cell suspension at 5000 Gs for 5 minutes at 4 degrees Celsius. 